All right, started off here. Um, this is a build video. Okay, it's a live commentary, build video, and um. So some of you guys were asking me in the stream and commenting like Legend, why you do so much damage, right? So for the Legend family that knows what happened with the internet, y'all know that I was tweaking some build videos, some builds. So I come across the build, very strong, but I tried to squeeze it a little bit more, but which I'm gonna do with you guys right now. So. This is the first time that I'm resetting my skill points. Okay, so the first time. Um, so, I'm resetting my skill points right now. It's gonna cost me a little bit gold. All right, it's okay. But as you can see right here. <clears throat> so, I'm gonna put all the points in burst. All right, we're gonna go full burst. And to show you literally what happens if you go full burst with this build. And I'm also gonna show you how it is without the full burst mode all right because this 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 build right here that i'm going to i'm going to show you guys is literally you got to have a healer with you you can't do it solo but you got to have literally a good momentum you could say you need to you need really need a good momentum so what you got to have a good healer with you in order to get this build out there like punched out so the abilities that i'm using right now uh, what I'm gonna use is uh, I'm using um, I'm using electric field for this um, for this loadout, and I'm using um, y'all maybe have maybe y'all have this ability I don't know, uh, but if you don't have it, it's it's a um, it's a rare one. It drops from a low level dungeon, but it's not easy to get if you, if you know what I mean. But you will get it, all right. But it's not easy to get. It's called innervate. All right, so innervate. Uh, what it does is that your mag your magic spell does one hundred more damage for eight seconds. All right, so if you equip this for eight seconds, like if you equip it, you'll get a boost. Okay, so let me demonstrate. So <clears throat> as you can see here, if I if I literally do this, it hits for that that amount. And I'm full burst. But keep in mind, keep in mind that my gear is not like um, full burst. My gear is on survival abilities. All right. So my gear is on survival ability. So that means that not everything is in spell damage. Okay. So not everything is in DPS. So survival ability because otherwise you got to get one shot and then you don't want that. Um, and also this one is full burst. So what I want to say is that, so keep that in mind, all right? But if I use Innervate, which will give me the boost, and then use this, you can see that big numbers are hitting. Very strong numbers right there, all right? But keep in mind, you can only use this ability for four seconds, all right? Four seconds. The reason why is because uh, electric field it's on a five second cooldown. You can say a 4.90 second cooldown, you can say. So basically, you can get it done and also redo it after. But it's not gonna be up that fast. So, but this is a very strong burst, um, burst uh, ability. So I wanted to show you guys in action if I'm with a good healer. Um, let's see who's a healer around here. Because when I show people stuff, I also want to show them in how it works. So he's a warrior. Um, he's a healer. So Natosh, uh, probably Nat, maybe Natosh, right? We're gonna go into a um, we're gonna go into a uh, to a rate plus thirty, right? We're gonna go into a rate plus thirty, and um, you're gonna see how the boss's health is going to be melted with this. Keep in mind, I'm not fully burst, all right? So I'm not fully burst. My, my abilities are, my specs right now, my skill points are unfully burst, but my gear is not fully burst. So I want to show you, demonstrate how this boss is going to get meltdown. down, all right? 
<clears throat> when I when I squeeze when I was squeezing oh no they just should not be joining in no 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 so when I squeeze my gear to to do extend the DPS the bot's gonna get destroyed right so I just wanted to show you guys that so let's demonstrate that real quick um let's demonstrate that real quick I don't know if they joined in or not joined in but I clicked it so we're gonna see um. So this one loadout that I want to show you guys because it's very strong. It is very strong. All right. It's very, very strong. But the only thing is that it comes with a price that you have a short, you have a little bit long cooldown. So the cooldown is a little bit longer than a normal ability. So let's just say you have an ability like that is for three seconds or four seconds. You will, you will get that, um, that innervate more of a plus. But if you don't have that, uh, I don't know why this guy joined because he's only going to make it harder and harder. Um, I just want to do it with one healer, right? But Jonah Slayer, gamer, he just joined in for no reason. Um, but yeah. Um, so this boss is a pain in the butt cheeks. But still, you're going to see how he gets melted. The, the reason is because right now, well, the more people join a raid, the harder the boss gets. The boss are not hard. This is just gonna get more health. That's it. Just they're gonna get more health. That's it. End of the line. He's not strong. He's not good. More health. That's it. So I don't know why he joined again, but let's get it done. All right. So innervate. You're gonna see this boss is gonna do a lot of AOE damage right here. Innervate. He has 20 ter trillion health, and then boom, 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 boom. All right. You see that his health. Drop tremendously, but this is the cooldown part. I got four seconds on the cooldown. You can see that. And then when I go again, another innervate, boom, 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 boom. He gets melted down. You see that? But without innervate, I'm going to show you, like, I do this without innervate. And you can see that it's not doing a lot of damage right there. It's not, right? Innervate is up. And then I hit him. And then you see that he triples down very, very strong. All right? You can... You can see that I'm a little bit squishy now. That's why I tell you, you gotta, you gotta have a healer with this one. You gotta have a healer that's on point. I'm squishy. You can see my health is dropping tremendously because I don't have the boost. Here you go, five second cooldown. Again, you can, you can go do in between if you can juggle. You know, put some more DPS in there, right? You can, you can juggle with some more DPS in there if you want. But then, as soon as the innovator is up, you pull down on these guys. They're gonna get melted down. The reason why these mobs are going that way is because this guy right here, Jonas Slayer, he just pulls them to them, all right? That's why. You should not be doing that at all. That's why these mobs are here. But because I got a good healer with me, they're going to get melted down, all right? So you can see that it's very bursty. And it's also having a little bit more survivability because keep in mind, if I would squeeze it, a little bit more, I will be very squishy. I will be a very squishy DPS mage, which I am right now a little bit already. All right. So keep that in mind. So if you let me click back the dungeon server. Um, so if you love this build, keep in mind again, you gotta have a a burst healer with you on point. All right. That is this build. I'm gonna call it. This build I'm going to call the Annihilation build, all right? Because you annihilating, annihilating, annihilating that mob or dungeon um, boss. It's a plus 30, so keep in mind. But this, you got to have a healer on point. Got to give it to you, on point, all right? This is the build, the Annihilation build, all right? Calling it the Annihilation build. But I got another one. All right, for my healers, low level healer, but we're gonna cut it right here on this build. So I hope you guys love the annihilation build. Keep in mind, you gotta have a healer with you. If you guys got questions whatsoever about the gear, how to put your specs, how to put your uh, your magic power where where in the in the how many percentage on the gear, comment down below this video or hit me up on Discord. See you guys soon. Bang bang, peace.